Good morning. I'm actually feeling pretty darn good, guys. Knock on wood. Where's your head? There you go. Uh, yeah. I've been up since five. I'm a little tired, but other than that, I mean, I'm doing pretty good. I have a headache. Did you? I'm sorry. It's all your fault. Probably is. <laughs> <laughs> I probably caused it. I'm very manic, though. I'm very, very manic. This has me a little concerned, going off of the medication. Well, I don't, I don't know. You're, you're a lot of fun when you're a medic. <laughs> I know, but I, I, when I'm overly manic, I tend to, to not sleep, and I tend to um, do silly things to hurt myself. Accidental, you don't hurt right. yourself well, on that's purpose. That's what I mean, like silly. That's and then you spend you spend money too, which is kind of hard to yeah. control. Yeah. Well, I do have. When one you get manic, I should take away all your cards. Well, I do have one more. One more. Uh, here we go. Megan's fundraiser for vet school stuff. I have. She's doing a fundraiser through Sensi. So I do have one more thing I have to deal with, with Scentsy, and then I'm done for a while until we run out of Scentsy bars. Then I have to buy more. Huh? Yeah. I'll get you all the Scentsy, all the bars you want from Walmart. No, they don't burn the same and they don't smell as good for as long. Like, I have them all off right now. Tonight I'll turn them all back on for the night lights, and the, you can still smell how fresh they are. <laughs> okay. So, no, I'm not getting Walmart ones. Sorry, no. <laughs> so, oh, my phone just went, hold on. <laughs> oh, it's my niece's birthday today. Yeah, how old is she? She's... Thirty-one. Groovy man. Thirty-one today. This shows how old you are. Does that make you feel old? No. That your niece is thirty-one. No. <laughs> I'm only twenty-nine. She's older than me. I'm well, how 29. crazy! You know, and your daughter is almost your age. What? She's twenty-five. My daughter's twenty-five. I had her <laughs> when I was four years old. Okay. Wow. All right. Enough birthdays. What are you doing today? Are you uh, helping me today? Until oh, you have a. I have, have an, an MRI, MRI appointment at, at three thirty. I have to be at the hospital at three thirty. Mm. Um. So, speaking uh -oh. of one of the devils. I thought you were doing. Bye, the bye guys. I'm just the bed first. The bed, huh? Yeah, the bed needs to be made. Yeah, Boomer needs somewhere to sleep. Well, he was sleeping on it earlier, and I didn't make it while he was on it, and now he got up, so I'm making it. <laughs> See, it's all nice and pretty now. All right, Boomer, you can go to bed now. Now you can go to bed, Boomer. All right, so I'm back in the basement, or at least until around 2.30, when I have to go take Val to get her MRI. I'm going to continue with these uh, two by fours in the wall. I'm just going to space them out at about uh, 24 inches on center. A little concerned because uh, I can't attach it directly to the wall, obviously, because it's pretty solid concrete. So it's actually sitting on two by fours that are sitting on the floor, very much like what's uh, over here. But this will be the the only stretch that's going to have shelves on it. So it's it's going to have a uh, some weight on the front of it so i'm a little concerned about that so it's going i'm going to shoot it into the top right now and i will be and shooting it 
into the bottom. And I will be going back and putting a, a three inch uh, screw in it. That'll help. And then I, I'm assuming I'm just gonna have to keep an eye on it. If it looks like it's pulling against away from the wall, uh, I may use some, uh, um, what do you call it, mastic glue. And that should keep it from coming down. But then that's kind of a permanent thing. Not too permanent, but I do have some mastic, not a lot, but uh, maybe I'll just do that so I don't have to worry too much. shelf hangers and I'm bringing out my blue ball that Val makes fun of so it, what this is is a um, a laser level by zircon <clears throat> turn it on it's got this cool blue light up it goes into this little metal cup that used to come with a uh, late stickers that that temporary stick on but lost those so all you have to do is level that up it's just like a, a bubble and it shoots a laser light all the way across the room and all I have to do is mark those hospital why you may ask are we at the hospital having you committed yep we're committing me there it's a mental go. hospital they're taking me in a straight room I mean in, in a padded room in a straight jacket and they're leaving me there right. forever and ever and ever and they're gonna tape my mouth shut too so I don't talk and drive them all crazy <laughs> mm -hmm. that's what they're gonna do actually we're here for my MRI and then I have an appointment with the doctor to go over my MRI on Tuesday. Ruby man. Go to Ruby man. See you then. Okay, guys. So I just finished with my MRI. A little, little, little upset. <laughs> just a little bit upset. Um, when the technician took me in, had to go over some paperwork and whatnot with the technician. 
and she says, oh, what did the doctor put you down for your here for? And she looks at the paperwork. She says, irritated muscles. And I'm like, what? And she says, yeah, irritated muscles. I said, okay, irritated muscles. All right. I just left it at that. And I hope they did a bone checked at my for tone right toe cuff and not just looked at my muscles in this MRI. Don't trust so, anybody anymore. Yeah, I mean this is crazy. If they didn't do the right test and and you know, I have to pay $200 for this test and it's not the right one, I'm not going to be a happy camper. So, hey guys. Anyway, so we're home from getting my MRI done. I already told you guys I'm not too happy with what I heard. Um, so, yeah. We'll see what happens when I go to the doctors on Tuesday. Hopefully he will have the MRI results by then. And, um, yeah, we can go from there. So, but... Uh, the video, Show Me Your Answers, will be going up today um, or tonight um, for you guys to type out your unscrambled words down below. And I threw a little twist in there, so when you watch that video, you'll know what it is, what the twist is. So have fun with it. Um... And that's about it for me. Um, Groovy man. What do you have to add? Nothing. No, you got to point the camera at yourself and say something to the camera. Just S say something. Something to the camera. You need to come up with a new happy word. Yeah, I know. It's been ruined. Yes. It has. <sighs> Such a sad, sad day. <laughs> Your happy word's been ruined. Yep. Angel, it's so sad. So, so sad. Are you ready to say goodbye? Are you ready to say goodbye? We're going to go ahead and call it an evening. <laughs> Goodbye. I love you. I love you. There you go. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye. You're, you're